up, break it, love, and Yankovic into the lead, the 2007 champion, trying to unseat the defending champion. Out in front early in Charleston. She may have played just about five hours more tennis this week than her opponent, but Yelena Yankovic is the one with the fresh legs. She sprints to a one set advantage in Charleston, taking the opening set from the defending champion. Oh, what a remarkable angle. Serena, are you kidding? Serena Williams blanks Yelena Yankovic in set number two. And we'll go to a third to decide the champion of the 2013 Family Circle Cup. Yeah! Frustration on one side, elation on the other. An insurance break for Serena Williams. She finishes it off at the net. She's a three-time champion. The handshake. We're the adversaries. But the day belongs to Serena Williams. For the third straight time in as many trips, 2008, 2012, and now 2013 champion with a three-set victory. Everybody, your champion. Let's hear it for Serena Williams. 15 consecutive match wins in Charleston for her third title here. It is the final of the 43rd edition of the Family Circle Cup. For the 21st time, American Club will be representing their country in the final. It is the number seven seed, Madison Keys, in action against the number five seed from Germany, Angelique Kerber. Keys will settle down into this final. One hole to serve, and here's her first break. On the bounces and also the wind. Yeah. Into the net from Madison Keys. She breathes a huge sigh of relief. The first set is on the board. It's in the bank here for Angela Kerber. It's at six games to two. Yeah. She wants to be right now, Keys. In the front foot and in the fourth court. We're getting closer and closer to the net. Back end of the second set, and Madison Keys has find the level. Game on once again in the final at Charleston. One set all, Keys takes it 6 4 with one break. It's been long from Angelique Kerber. It's Madison Keys who strikes the first blow in the deciding set. Wow, that's huge. What an important point. Well, she put her cards on the table again, Madison Keys. That's the long from Madison Keys. There's a hush around the family circle stadium, and the reason for that is Kerber has her second break of serve when she walks back from the chair. Out, Kerber drops to her knees. He's on the floor. 
What a final we've just witnessed here in Charleston. It's her first title since 2013. Lucky for Angelique Kerber in her 13th final in her career. Well, here in three sets against Madison Key, 6 2, 4 6, 7 5. What a final we've just witnessed here from the German. It is the final of the 44th edition here in Charleston. And for the delight of perhaps the tournament organisers, the sponsors, no doubt the public, it is an American player, Sloane Stevens, who is about to contest the title here against the Russian Elena Vesnina. Nice volley. First holder serve, it is the American Stevens who has it. With that hold, she leads the first set, two games to one. That's some good tennis and great job for Sloane Stevens, who's bringing back balls. She's fighting really hard out there, moving very well. Oh, that is incredible tennis from both players. And it comes from Viznina off the return of serve to begin with. Excellent defensive tennis at its best from Sloan Stevens. And I have to give her a 10 out of 10 for stickability. 10 out of 10 for bounce back ability as well, the American. She opens up on that trusty old backhand of her, Sloane Stevens. It did the trick in the tiebreaker. The American has the first set on the board. Side at Stevens he continues the momentum here. An early break. And there it is, sent down the line to the point of no return. It is Sloan Stevens, well and truly in the ascendancy now in this final. A set and 4 1. made it once again you mentioned the footwork that was much better here how she slides into that forehand at the fourth attempt Sloane Stevens has won her third title of 2016 and it is her second title on home soil and with this win here today she becomes the 21st American player to win the title here at Charleston it's a warm embrace and a kiss at the net. What a final it was. And Vesnina all week has displayed some wonderful tennis, but she met her match today, and Sloane Stevens is enjoying a very fruitful campaign thus far. And then there were two. It's finals day here in beautiful Charleston, and the two contenders remaining are both teenagers. A pair of 19-year-olds will battle it out in South Carolina's oldest city. One of these players is about to win their first ever WTA singles title. Will it be Yelena Rostopenko of Latvia or Daria Kazatkina of Russia? Oh, brilliant. Kazatkina fizzes that one down the line. Made that look pretty simple the uh, Russian. But it is Kasik Kina who is able to take the second break point. Oh. 
It is long, and Ostapenko does get the break back immediately. There we are. Kasatkina finds another break. It is three breaks on the bounce. Kasatkina leads four games. Well, Kasatkina does open up a two-game cushion. We haven't seen either player have a two-game cushion. Kasatkina has one now, five, three. A game away from taking this opening set of the final. Kasatkina takes the first set of the final. And that is, I'm afraid to say, handed on a plate. Got it. Darian Kasatkina is a game away from the title. Daria Kasatkina, the champion of Charleston. It's her first ever WTA singles title. A day to remember in the career of this young Russian star. And this all-teenage battle in South Carolina goes the way of Daria Kasatkina. She's delighted. And then there were two. Katrofi is on the line here in Charleston. Two players who have been searching for form in 2019, have certainly found it here at the Volvo Car Open. Caroline Wozniacki, former world number one and a former champion of this event, will square off with Madison Keys, who is being to become the ninth American woman to conquer Charleston. That's big. That's giant power yes. from Keys. Now oh, she's gonna love that. Love she that hammers team. it away. She guessed the right way, was Niaki, but there was enough pace and power on it. Game Takes it in style. What a way to seal the first set. Seven games to six. A smile from coach as Madison Keys takes one big step towards the trophy here in Charleston. Gorgeous, perfect placement. Oh, that's outstanding. One ball, two balls. Remarkable striking from Madison Keys. That's going to help yeah, out. Geez. The apology is there, but Keys will take that. She wishes she had that kind of combo earlier. Great serve. Yeah, 
Madison Keys, Keys, the champion in Charleston. To six, like, seven, six, six, three. She becomes the ninth American player to win the trophy in this great historic city in South Carolina. She's always enjoyed playing here. She's been a runner-up before. She was close to another final here 12 months ago. Well, this year, it is her time.